So these prosecutors, you're saying, have ties. So our U.S. prosecutors have ties to the CCP. So go from there. Go ahead. Yes, absolutely. So we did a research about the background of the federal prosecutor and investigator from the SEC, from the uh, DOJ. So I'm going to uh, name the name, okay? Sure. So this, the assistant U.S. attorney, um, Juliana Murray, uh, she is the um, lead prosecutor of Moscow's case. And uh, she used to um, work for Davis and Polk, which is a huge U.S. law firm, uh, had business in China. So Davis Park is a U.S. law firm with huge business in communist China, and they support the CCP's crackdown on the Hong Kong student uh, freedom movement. And you can look it up. And uh, also there's a guy by the name of the uh, Southern District of New York prosecutor, Mika Ferguson. He used to work at Skatton. This is another big law firm who have represented the CCP kleptocrats, the Soho China owned by Pan Shiyi, uh, a CCP top, you know, uh, cadre, and Cai Xing, uh, uh, the editor-in-chief of the CCP's chief propaganda magazine, Cai Xing, that woman's name is Hu Shuli. So, so this law firm, Scanton, represents the CCP kleptocrats, suing Mr. Mao's school back in 2017. And now the lawyers and partners coming from this same very law firm are prosecuting Mr. Mao's school. And they are the Southern District of New York prosecutor. And also the SEC civil case prosecutor, Daniel Loss, he also worked for Davis Park. That is uh, an American law firm with big business in China. And also, Luke Despin's own lawyer, Luke Despin, is the one, is a DOJ-appointed trustee sitting over Mr. Moscow's case. And his employer, Paul Hastings, had helped the CCP government issuing the bond and helping the CCP's uh, state-owned enterprises to get funding, private, uh, you know, uh, uh, equity. So Luke Despin's, you know, he is a DOJ-appointed trustee, and he came from a big law firm that is relying on CCP to do business. Okay. And Luke Desmond's own lawyer is Greg Andrew. He's a partner at Davis and Park. So, you know, we're going to publish a map showing the connections. Who are the federal prosecutors? Who are the investigators uh, handles? Who handles this uh, Moscow's case? And we will map out, you know, their money ties, their financial in- incentives with the CCP kleptocrats. 